Welcome to the individual coffee fundraiser by Mission Coffee Roasters, hosted on the Finish Line Planner model library of pre-built plans. This particular model can be used by an individual who's raising funds to go on a missions trip or for a ministry cause. And this model will engage the church leadership in helping them to promote their ministry and the fundraising that they are doing. We'll start by going to finishlineplanner.com and at the home page you want to log in on the login option in the menu in the upper left hand corner. If you have not signed up for Finish Line Planner, you can start an account by clicking on the sign up button. On the login page, enter your email and password. If you've forgotten your password, you can click on the forgot password button and have your password reset. You will arrive on the team build page. On this particular page, you will want to enter the full name, email address, and cell phone number of each team member, and then click on the Create Team Member button to create your team. Next, we want to click on the Models option in the menu, and that will take us to the Model page, which is divided into two parts. In the top, you'll see My Models. These are the models that are available for you to use. In the Model Library, there will be pre-built plans created by industry experts that are available to you. We will want to scroll down to the individual coffee fundraiser plan. Notice at the end of the description there's a PDF link. If you click on that link, that is going to open a helpful guide. Review this guide for instructions and information about how to raise the money selling the Mission Coffee Roasters coffee. Notice it is a three-page guide. On the second page, you will see there's a fundraising order form. And on the third page is the form that you use when you send your order and money for the coffee. Now you want to click on the Install button from the Individual Coffee Fundraiser. And the confirmation dialog will come up asking for your confirmation to send your contact information to the Mission Coffee Roaster team. And they will be there to assist you and help you with your fundraiser. Click on the OK button. And now the model is available under My Models. Next, you want to click on the Plans option in the upper left-hand corner menu. And then you want to click on the Add Plan button. Here's the Add Plan dialog. And in this dialog, you would want to drop down the option under the Model field. And you'd want to choose the Individual Coffee Fundraising Model. Next, you want to put in the name of your event. And then you'd want to put in the date. This uh, date should be one date for both the start and end. But this date is the date that you want to end your fundraiser. This is when you're going to get your last order from your last customer by this date. And then you want to click on the Create button. This will bring you into the Plan Designer. And it will have the first milestone open for you, the organized uh, milestone. And then on the black uh, boxes, each one represents a task. And in that second field, you want to drop that down, and you want to select the person that you want to assign that task to. So most of these will be to the individual who's doing the fundraising, except for the few uh, church tasks that are used to help to promote the funds fundraising. Uh, there's an X in the corner of the um, task, and that little blue X is for deleting any task that may be something that doesn't apply to you. Then you want to enter in the dates for the task. It's a start plan date and a finish plan date. And you choose those from the calendar. Notice that the dates that you enter have to be on or before the milestone date. So for the organizing milestone, in this particular case, has to be before June the 13th, 2016. So enter the dates from the calendar. Once you've entered in the dates, the task turns white. That means this task is scheduled and is ready. So next we want to click on the uh, Prepare Contacts List uh, milestone. That milestone will open and the organized one will close. And here's where you're going to develop uh, all the channels and list of people that you can approach with your fundraiser. And uh, notice that it has a milestone date and all the tasks here need to be done by that milestone date. The next milestone is uh, Execute Fundraiser, and this is the actual work of going around through the different channels and making your appeal and selling coffee. 
Then you want to uh, complete your order and the delivery. And so these tasks will help you uh, once you've gone around and got all your orders to get your orders in and to distribute uh, your orders. And then you want to follow up uh, with thank you notes. Uh, make sure it's into the newsletter, take pictures, share that, uh, post on social sites, uh, work the work that you're doing on the mission field, and let people know that you appreciate their support. This is the clipboard where you will update the statuses of tasks as they are completed. And there will be more details in our Insight help videos. But I just want to show you this little slider bar with the blue dot. That represents the percentage a task is done. So this task here is 75% done, and this one is 25% done. That's how you update your status of your task. Uh, this is a view of our Appless app or a text messaging system. So through a smartphone, people are able to update their uh, task and statuses rather quickly, and you'll find a video in our Insight videos that will help you with that. This is our Insight video page. You get there by clicking on the Insights option from the menu. And we're on the Getting Started tab, and we want to point out the updating tasks. This particular video will go over uh, how to update your statuses in the clipboard. On the far right here is the Appless app text messaging interface video, and this will show you how to use the smartphone to update your statuses. In the middle, you'll notice there's a Create Plans video. That video will be uh, helpful for how to use the plan designer that we were in with all the milestones and tasks. If you click on the Advanced tab, you'll find that there's a Managing Volunteers and Team video. This is how to set up your team and manage their security. And on the far right is the Finish Line Planner administrative video. That will help the person who's in charge manage your Finish Line Planner account. There's also a Professionals tab with a lot of additional videos on how to use Finish Line Planner in, in specific situations and different models like this one. This particular model is brought to us by Mission Roasters, and you can go to their site at missioncoffeeroasters.com. Uh, they have many different types of fundraisers, uh, ministries for churches, and ways that they can uh, help you with coffee.